In this equation, we have potassium sulfate plus barium nitrate. Let's balance this equation, and we're going to do a little bit of a trick here to make this easier. This is a double displacement reaction. The potassium and the barium, they're switching places. So watch how we do this. We'll count the potassiums. We have two of those. And then we have a sulfate here and a sulfate here. It's a polyatomic ion. It stays together in this chemical reaction. So we can count this as just one item. Barium, we have one. And then the nitrate, we have it here and we have it here again, this NO3. It's a polyatomic ion. Let's count this as one thing as well. We have one nitrate times two. We have two of those. On the product side, we have one potassium, the one sulfate, one barium, and one nitrate. Because we count these polyatomic ions as one thing, it becomes very clear that all we really need to do is double our potassium and double our nitrate. And we can just put a coefficient of two in front of the KNO3. 1 times 2, we've balanced our potassiums. Our 1 nitrate here times 2, that gives us 2 nitrates. And we're done. This equation is balanced. So you can see the value of counting these polyatomic ions is one item if they appear on both sides of the chemical equation. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for K2SO4 plus BaNO32. Thanks for watching.